What's happening YouTube? Funko Pops back here with our latest unboxing video for some Funko Pops. And today we have a really exciting one. We are trying to do this in another video that you've probably seen on my channel before. But after we pulled the top hit out of the box we opened before this one, we had to make that one video by itself. And if uh, you don't remember what I'm referring to or didn't watch that video, I'm referring to when I pulled this black and white Wolverine out of a Chalice Collectibles box. It was out of their weekly box that they do. It was $21 and you know I pulled that so I didn't expect it. So uh, make sure I will link that video above. So if you haven't seen that video make sure you check that one out because that's one you're not going to want to miss. Who wants to miss uh, someone pulling a grail? But anyways this was a Spastic Collectibles box. This was the one we were supposed to open with that other Chalice box but um, like I said you know with what happened we didn't. Um, but this one I was actually more excited for because this one, the other one was only 21 bucks. This one is 70, cost me 75 bucks and it was $11 and some change shipping. So it was like 86 something total. Um, but this one had the guaranteed value of 75 bucks. Now it was a hunt for three different like grails that are Marvel themed. And I'll show you a picture right here of the top three. So there were a total of 50 boxes. Um, Three of them, three of those 50 boxes, you know, had one of those top prizes in it. So, I mean, 50 boxes and three of them, that's not bad odds. I mean, obviously, it's still in favor of the house, but I mean, hopefully we can get one in there. Uh, it says it comes anywhere from two to up to four pops. That's all it said, up to four. Now, I've grabbed some other Funko, and looking at it, you know, how big this box is. The max they could fit in here is three. So, I'm hoping there's only two in here and that we got a top pick. But uh, let's get right into this one. I'm super excited for it. If we could pull another Grail after just pulling that other one from Chalice. Can't, couldn't get much better than that. But obviously it's a long shot for that. But let's see. So seems like it's bubble wrapped pretty well. I have a feeling it feels like three pops, unfortunately. So you got the spastic collectible sticker right there. I'm trying to take the bubble wrap off without looking. Okay. And without damaging the pops. Okay, we got some off. Okay, so no stack. We got no hard stack, so I can tell you right now we didn't get top prize. Ah, oh, it sucks. We only got one soft protector, it feels like, too. So we'll just go from left to right, because right has the soft protector. If I can get one out without looking. All right, so our first one in three, two, one. Now that's cool, we got Buzz Lightyear. I don't really think he's worth anything, but that's a cool one. From Toy Story 4, why couldn't it be one of the older ones? So that is the first pop that we're getting from this box. So I'm hoping that the other, I don't think he's worth much. So I'm hoping that he's not actually, and I hope this next one actually isn't worth anything either, and then the last one's worth something, but here we go, I think this is top three. Two, one, oh, you. oh man, this sucks. We got the gelatinous cube. <sighs> you could have bought this one at GameStop for 16 bucks, and I, I'm sorry, 15 bucks. And I think the PPG is like 37, so you're taking up so much value just in that one. That sucks. Um, just because, like I said, I could have bought it in the store if I really wanted it for $15. Now I'm getting, paying 37 in a sense, unless this one is just a really good one, but let's find out this one is in the protectors not a hard stack but it's in the protector let me see if i can feel the top okay i think this is the top and the front in three two one. Oh man wow this box sucked oh wow yeah, I mean, if you guys are interested, just let me know in the comments below. I might actually just sell this J. Balvin with uh, Common as well. Try to get rid of both of them together. See if that's any easier. But let's check the Funko app. See what we got. Yep. We got $7 for his Buzz Lightyear. Uh, I don't know. If, yep, this one doesn't have any trending data yet. And I doubt. Let's see if this one does. Okay, and th this one's worth 44 bucks. So you got 51 between those two, and like I said, it was guaranteed 75 bucks. So this one has to be at least $26. Let's check PPG. Yeah, so PPG value is showing 36 bucks for this guy. 
Like I said, I think he's way overpriced right now. He's a newer pop, so he's probably going to go down in value. So, um, Not one of the better videos. I mean, some people will probably be happy with this, but I don't even... I, before I started getting into Funko, I, to be honest, I didn't even know who Jay Balfin was. Um, Still don't really know who he is. I didn't even look him up, honestly, but I just know he's a Funko pop and it has the rock, rocks next to it. But So um, if you guys enjoyed this video, um, like I said, make sure you hit that like and subscribe, and uh, we'll see you guys for the next one.